Well hello there and welcome to this video where we're going to take a look at setting up an access token to activate your plugin. Now if this is the first time you are setting up an access token then possibly just watch through this video the first time and then the second time around you can just follow along and do it yourself. Now access tokens are really great and they give you a secure way of searching the Facebook database and this is what you'll need to use your plugin and I'm at developers.facebook.com I'm going to head over to my apps and from here I'm going to choose add new app and we're going to get a bit of a wizard here it's just going to walk us through the process of creating a new app I'm going to select website I'm just going to create a name here and you can name it anything you like and then you just need to enter your email address and select the relevant category and choose create app ID. We can select here skip quick start and that's going to take you to the app dashboard. Now we'll just go to tools and support. We'll go to access token tool and here you can find your app all you need to do is click the link here that says need to grant permission. We'll just go OK here and we're done. So next to the user token here what you can do is click on the debug option and you'll find a link that says extend access token. And here we can see our long access token you can copy that and use that in the settings in your plugin. That's how easy it is to get your access token set up with Facebook and your plugin is ready to go. To extend the access token, you'll come back to this page and you'll just click extend access token and it's going to give you the access token. You just need to do that once every three months.